back to our JNS YouTube channel. Um, today we've got one of the members of staff's helmet, um, which is absolutely minging. There's a lot of road grime out at the moment, a lot of salt on the road. Obviously, yeah, it makes a mess of the helmets. We need to get them clean and we need to get them clean fast, get rid of all the acids and all the salts that are attacking the, the helmets themselves. Um, so he's already started stripping it down uh, and we're gonna just uh, demonstrate some of the products that we sell at JNS. Uh, and how good they are and how efficient they are at getting rid of all the grime and then what we're also going to do because his visor is absolutely filthy as well uh, we're going to clean half the visor and then we're going to treat the visor with something called um, visor proof by knit wax and we're going to show you how uh, effective that is at dispersing water as well so a bit of a two-parter Okay, so you can see how dirty the helmet is. We're just going to use uh, some of the muck off uh, visor and lens cleaner. Spray a few pumps on. Give it a second or two just to uh, soak into the grime. We're then just going to use, first of all, a tissue, a tissue just to wipe off the majority, uh, and gently wipe off, I should say, the majority of them of the muck okay at this stage we don't really want to be rubbing because there's probably some salt in there and we don't want to obviously rub and 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 you know create scratches in the helmet so as you can see we're just wiping off the dirt that the uh, visor cleaner has just lifted okay so no rubbing at this at this stage Okay, once you've got the, the majority of it off, you can then just give it another spray. And if you want this time, now all the muck's gone, you can use a microfiber cloth and it'll be a little bit more aggressive uh, with your cleaning because we know now we're not gonna damage the helmet anyway. We're not gonna scratch it. All the salt's gone, all the grime's gone. We're just putting a nice finish back onto the helmet and already you can see the difference from when we started to now okay so here's that disgustingly dirty visor <laughs> what we're going to do we're going to take half of it off we're going to clean half and then we're going to treat half and then we're going to um, show you uh, with water how effective the treated half is and as i said before we're treating it with the nick wax visor proof so i'm just going to uh, so you split this visor roughly down the middle. Doesn't have to be exact, of course, like that. Again, we're going to use the muck off uh, visor lens and goggle cleaner. A couple of pumps on there. Because we know there's, there's going to be bits of, of grit and all sorts, we're just going to go ever so gently with hardly any pressure at all. Um, the liquid is very effective at what it does and it will lift the muck off. Okay, as you can see, it's all there. Okay, so that's that bit. Same as before, another couple of squirts and then a clean microfiber cloth. And you can just go a little bit more aggressively, but you don't really need to, to be fair. You can see that it's clean. Okay, that's that bit. We're then gonna wait for that to dry and we're gonna apply the visor proof. Okay, this is the, uh, this is the visor proof and this is available in all the stores. Um, it repels water off the visor. Uh, as soon as you get up to sort of 30, 40 miles an hour, the wind itself hitting the visor will repel uh, and bead the water off really good at what it does stops the water staying on stops you having to wipe the visor obviously if you wipe the visor you, you could um, scratch the visor uh, so the, the the little the least you touch this visor the better so that's where this stuff comes into its own so we're going to apply this now a couple of pumps on i'm going to get um, a piece of tissue and we're going to again gently just rub it into the visor very gently just like that and then we're going to wait for it to dry 
Okay, so we'll take the tape off now. So I don't know if you can see that if you're going a bit closer, but we've got an untreated bit of visor and a treated bit of visor. And now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna uh, yeah. spray some water on it. Okay, and then we're gonna blow from the top. And hopefully you can see the difference. That's the treated bit, that's the untreated bit. Untreated bit is still holding a lot of water. The treated bit, the water's almost all gone. So the visor proof is it's definitely worth, worth its weight in gold. It doesn't hold onto the visor. It, it, it makes the water just blast straight off. I say I'm only blowing lightly on it here. <laughs> Blow with a bit more pressure. Treated side, the water's completely gone. The water is still holding on the untreated side. In winter, it's an absolute godsend if you're in bad weather, wet weather. Um, I couldn't recommend it enough. And I say it's available in all the GNS stores. It's a Nick Wax visor proof. Please remember to like and subscribe our YouTube channel. Uh, ding the little bell to get the notifications and more videos like this. And we'll see you on the next one.